we are handset. That's not a handset from Nokia. That's actually our S3 with our fancy little logo on the, on the back. But what I would like to show you is a little comparison between the new flagship phone from Nokia, that's the Lumia 920 and the S3 over here. Well, this one sports a 4.5 inch display. This one came with a 4.8 inch display. Sports a quad core processor. This one has a dual core processor. Both are about, yeah, each core is almost the same because both are based on the um, Cortex A9. Well, no, actually the S4 is already Qualcomm's version of the Cortex A15. Um, but what I would like to show you is, in terms of the size, you can tell it's almost the same here. And also in terms of the display resolution, they are almost the same. Even though they're calling this an HD Plus display, that means 1280 by 768. Well, this one has uh, 1280 by 720, as far as I know. Um, on, the, on the back, we both devices are sporting an 8 megapixel camera. But this one comes with the pure view technology and, of course, with the called size lens. And what we would like to show you is um, that the image quality is uh, quite different uh, when we're taking a look at the Lumia one. So we have some pictures here that were taken with the new Lumia 920 and a comparison picture of the Samsung Galaxy S3. That's the one with the Lumia 920. And, it's like a, and here comes the one with the Galaxy S3, of course, without flash right now, right? Here's the Lumia 920 again. That's the S3 without flash, and that's the S3 with flash. Let's, let's, let's go two back again so we can see the difference. There you go, and I think that's what PureView technology is all about. Uh, we know how superior this is compared to other uh, cameras and phones. But especially uh, when you compare this to um, yeah, the, the, the flagship phone from Samsung with definitely a great camera. Comparing this to the PureView, that's still a huge difference. That's the Samsung Galaxy S3 and that's the new Nokia Lumia.